My name is Mark Robinson. I'm a meteorologist at the Weather Network and I've been chasing storms for about uh, 10 years now and that includes hurricanes, tornadoes, blizzards, ice storms, water spouts, you name it, if it's weather I'm after it. Storm chasing is an exercise in patience and starting again and doing it again and again and again. The real ratio of driving to you know pure adrenaline amazing stuff is about 8,000 to 1. <laughs> you know I'll spend uh, 8 to 10 hours on the road on a given day in, in Tornado Alley before we ever see even see a storm. There's definitely um, a respect that you have to have for the weather and especially for the events that I go after. I mean hurricanes are absolutely de deadly and they're devastating. You know, so when I go down beforehand, you know, I do definitely get what I love to call the hurricane jitters. Because, you know, this is, you know, you're basically right in the path of a major natural disaster. And that'll, that'll make you a little nervous. Uh, you know, storm chasing is not only an adrenaline rush, it's actually a real intellectual pursuit as well. Because you really have to know what you're doing. You really have to forecast, figure out what's going on that day. And that's not just jumping on a roller coaster and going, ooh, you know, I've had fun. Um, it really takes a lot of work and a lot of knowledge and to get that knowledge you know I had to end up going back to school so that I could get a full understanding of the meteorology and of what's going on in the atmosphere. My car is my it's a rolling laboratory it's a rolling data collection center and it's actually also a rolling film studio so I can actually edit film from there I can stream live from the car I can gather all the information I need for forecasting and for chasing and I can usually stay safe in it. So far, so good.